While this heat may be creating more clucking from the birds, fortunately for farmers, it has not silenced any. President of the Egg and Poultry Producers Association, Stephen Lane, told CBC News that mortality is not being reported, but the farmers with traditional pens are the ones most at risk. Um, some of them will put in um, uh, fans, large 36-inch um, uh, to 48-inch diameter fans to push the air around. But if you um, pushing around hot air, um, it is of not much help. So we try to um, cool that air down sometimes with, with water, um, a light mist of water in it to um, cool it down. That certainly will help. Um, but it is a challenge um, for, this, for, for this. And and the challenge also include that you have the risk of high mortality and stress in the animals and slow growth rate. Um, all of those um, we have to overcome by better management of of the houses and making sure the wires are clean and as much uh, ventilation happens um, during the day. Scientist and director of the Center for Biosecurity at the Cape Hill campus, Dr. Kirk Douglas, says the intensity of the humidity is what must be kept in check. Coming on to the tail end of the hurricane season, um, what farmers usually will try to do is to implement the uh, increase the movement of air um, because that helps to reduce the heat stress on birds. But if this isn't done, then this could cause uh, heat stress for the birds and also lead to mortality um, within within the flock. Those with wind tunnel pens are not as worried. Have less stocking density. So there's a, a little bit more space in the houses um, because the birds generate a lot of heat themselves. Um, and therefore, you need to stock but less than what the capacity of the poultry house is. The other issue which poultry farmers are faced with is the presence of bird flu in Belize. Dr. Douglas says while the outbreak is still under investigation, it appears to be a milder strain of avian influenza. The level of path pathogenicity of this strain has not been determined yet, but from the preliminary report, it would appear that it's a low path um, avian influenza virus but testing is currently ongoing to determine the exact identity of this in subtype being H5, one of the um, low or high pathogenic given influenza viruses. There has been some, some mortality in the flock, but not excessive mortality. Mr. Lane assured that the sanitary measures on farms have been stepped up. And all poultry farms have put in place, um, especially the larger ones, an area where people just can't walk on. And even those that are working there have to observe um, that biosecurity vehicles driving in have to drive through um, a pool, water that has um, um, chemicals in it to, 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 to kill any bacteria um, that for vehicles that might be delivering feed or, or transporting other, other equipment and, 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 and supplies to that farm. The BAPA president assured that with both issues under control and heavy surveillance, as well as the larger growers having tunnel pens, there should be no shortage of chicken or eggs for the upcoming Independence and Christmas seasons. Wendy Burke, CBC News.